yeah. it was a fun project. It was it was definitely a fun project. I think it was one of those um, interesting problems to solve for, and the time that we were able to accomplish is, I think, that's phenomenal. In about ten months, we were able to go live with this integration. Yeah. Hi, my name is Sai Maroju. I'm uh, the application manager at Amazon. Uh, we manage Trigalis Accounting. My name is Joe Malora, and I work for uh, eBusiness Strategies as a CTO. What we tried to do um, at Amazon was integrate um, the lease administration system with uh, Trireka, where we were doing lease accounting. It was challenging with multiple fronts because we had our downstream system up and running, and we were establishing an upstream system, and we had to dock two two machines together. Um, and, and make sure you know the data points aligned. Yeah, and we decided to go with a, an event-driven type architecture based off the just the number of requirements there were and um, the, the fact that there were, I wouldn't say changing, but new requirements based off data that was coming through. We need to, it, basically we had to replay whatever changed in the other system. So we had to determine what change, what order, there may be some user interactions, so it would have to wait until they did their thing. There could be some state transitions, which meant processing, you never know what time, you don't know exactly when they were going to end. Um, so it had to be able to resume and go through the entire process of, of processing a, a particular lease. It was um, a data-driven uh, approach design. Would you agree? Yeah, I totally agree with that. I, I totally agree with that. And it was kind of cool because you could see, as you're generating the events, you can see when it processes, you look at it and go, okay, this is what it thought needed to change. Um, you can see, okay, was that accurate, or did some, or do we need to code for different requirements based off the data? Yeah, when we presented this award, it was uh, our our business case. Um, it was really on the technical architecture side on how we were able to look at the use case and how we were able to solve it uniquely. And we had a lot of good people involved on both sides of the aisle all the way through, and I th I think it was good, especially under the compressed time frame, and it got. Got a little stressful at times, so I, I think it was good to be able to have that recognition and be able to just talk about and give some recognition to the to the people involved with it. Behind it. I think right from the business side too, right? Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I we had great business partnership too in terms of how we were seeing anomalies and and sometimes you know not every every time you know a technical approach could solve it. Um, so we went back to the business and they were open enough to change business process to accommodate those requirements. And then obviously these guys were like architecting our, our crazy thought. Yeah, and if I wasn't clear, that's, that's what I meant, the entire team all the way through. <laughs> Fantastic.